Hey there guys, how are you? Welcome to a brand new flip trip. We're in the new flipmobile and in about 25 seconds this video is going to cut to me in my garage. It's going to be like the prequel to the flip trip. You'll see what I'm talking about. Ah, Mountain Dew. It's like the nectar of the gods or in my opinion it's like my own personal battery acid. Without it, I can't recharge. Okay, so before this flip trip begins, I want to let you know this flip trip's brought to you by a very awesome fitness channel. You're going to see what I'm talking about. I have a very cool video clip to show you. I think a lot of you guys out there are going to appreciate it. But after you watch this video clip, you're going to be like, I want to go to the gym right now and get a pump. Check this out. Do you want to learn the best workout from the top bikini and fitness models? Well, then check out Bikini Model Fitness. Oh yeah, that's called Bikini Model Fitness. It's fun stuff. Obviously, you could tell by that by watching the video clip. I rather enjoy it. So anyway, uh, go to their channel, subscribe. You can click the annotation right here. Uh, link down below in the description box. Watch all their videos. It, like, it's just, it's enjoyable. All of those ladies are total knockouts. Go there, subscribe to their channel, and tell them Johnny Flickster sent you. They're gonna get scared after you say that. Anyway, yeah, go there, check it out. That right there is the new Flickmobile. I know it's not the Tumblr. It does come in black, though. Uh, the only difference is my car has 40,000 miles on it. It's a Dodge Caliber. It's not meant for military use, but it does fire missiles at little children. And that's what they get for playing in the middle of the street. But not only did I get a new Flickmobile, I got something else. Something a little bit cooler, a little bit sleeker. I got a new Flick Pod. Check this out. It's the new Flick Pod. It's mobile, baby. That way we can go through the streets of Gotham all slick-like. Now, I know what you're thinking. Here's what I do. I keep this in the back of my Dodge Caliber because the seats fold down. That way, if a crazy-ass clown comes up beside me in a semi and starts shooting bazookas at me, when my car blows up and the wheels fall off, I fly to the hatchback in this mountain bike right here. And then I die instantly. But check out my cool flashlight. Now, if you want to serve true justice, you got to have one of these. Okay, so before we head out on an all-new Flick trip, I have one serious question to ask you. Since we're doing so many comparisons with the new Flickmobile to the Tumblr and my mountain bike to the, uh, the Bat Pod, but here's my question to you. If you guys aren't sold on this yet, come down here. Did the Bat Pod have a water jug on it? Okay? The Batman was thirsty. He couldn't just do this. No, he could not. Hey there, guys. How are you? Welcome... God, why do cars tell me to put my seatbelt on? If It's my choice if I want my head to go through the windshield. There, okay? Are you happy now? Okay. Uh, so here's my question to you guys. Where do you want to go today? I'm not quite sure. It is raining out. There's a storm of brewing. I kind of like it, though. I'm sorry. The fact is there's nothing more motivating in life than a 1980s rock song sung by a man wearing tight denim pants with holes in it. And I stand by that. There it is. Can you see it lurking in the shadows? Corporate consumerism. Stealing mom and pop jobs across America. But you know what? They have cheap low prices and I like it. Even though the floors are always dirty, even though they're cleaning them, Walmart is a disgusting place, but I like to call it my home away from home. Here, I know where I can set the camera. Let's. Just, I'm gonna set you in here. Don't get scared. Good night, everyone. Okay, it, does, it won't even close. <laughs> Sit there for the next 10 minutes with that camera angle. Okay, I'm just kidding. Come here. All right, why is a 27-year-old guy in the toy section at Walmart? I don't know why. It just makes me feel like I'm a kid again. It's cheaper than therapy. By the way, that was How to Train Your Dragon toys. I did see the movie How to Train Your Dragon the other day. A little bit late, but I enjoyed it. It got a little bit dark. People die. I appreciate that. And uh, here, want to see my impression of Jay Baruchel? <laughs> I don't know what that was, I'm sorry. Who's buying this shit? Like, if you're a kid, just paint your face green and flex your muscles. You don't need the whole plastic mask. And you had to feel like a man again. After I get done looking at the toy section, I had to come to the grill section. This is where you cook meat. Raw red meat. Nothing makes you feel more like a man when you're cooking meat over an open flame. Sharp things. Oh yeah. Oh, I love the smell of bike tires. Now, I didn't buy my bike from here. I bought my bike from Target. I don't trust the bikes put together at Walmart. I just feel like you're gonna be riding down the, the street one day, a bolt's gonna fly out, your head's gonna go into the concrete, you're gonna be laying there for six hours, bleeding out of your mouth. But I do like the smell of bike tires. I'm serious. There's some kind of weird chemical in there. It's, 
I think you guys should try it out just once. Oh my god, look at this tire right there. Looks like it's made out of butter. Okay, there's one more thing we have to look at before we leave Walmart. Disappointed. It smells like corporate greed. Um, I gotta look at the t-shirts. There's nothing better than a good Walmart t-shirt. Now, you don't come by them very often. Every once in a while, you find something a little bit magical, a little bit mystical, for $7.50. Let's see what we got here. And not a fan of Superman. I already have eight Batman shirts. Oh, I might get that. Look at that. Look how, look how fun that looks. Robin in your lap. Holding a grappling hook? Looks like a good Friday night. Yeah. Why does everyone look at you when you hold a video camera in Walmart? It's like it's just a video camera. It's not an AK-47, people. Let's calm down. Okay, so that's Walmart. Uh, yeah, I was going to look at movies there, and I kind of did. I walked through them, but four seconds later, I realized that they don't have anything new or worth looking at in their deals. Remember when Walmart used to have really good deals on DVDs and Blu-rays and things like that? But now it's kind of like one of the worst places to go, or at least in my opinion. Um, how much? Ooh, we don't got much battery juice left. The battery juice is running out, everyone. I'm gonna pour some Mountain Dew on the camera to get it energized. Actually, that'd be stupid. Look at that sky right there. The gods have spoken. It's time to pay for our sins against humanity. Take me first. I'm guilty. Okay, let's stop and make a replay. The biggest used DVD and Blu-ray place in uh, Indiana. That's a lie. Fort Wayne. I know that much. Indiana might be a bit of a. Eh, I'm gonna stand by it. I'm gonna go out on a limb. If it's not true, don't try to correct me. Okay, so I'm on my way to Best Buy right now. I just came out of a disc replay, uh, mega replay. Sorry, I gotta define its largeness. And uh, I didn't feel comfortable recording in there. I just, I tried to, but okay, here's, if you're a hipster, don't take offense to this, but that place is not, it, nothing but hipsters work there. And I'm sorry to say, I don't know enough about plaid shirts and uh, coffee to fit in. There it is in the distance. Best Buy, the dragon dueling whore, looking at us. The last time I seen this was in 1654, when its flame killed my family. I came back at the beast with a dagger, and I thrust it into its heart. I took my dagger, and I thrust it to the sky with the power of the gods behind me, and the- Okay, I'm just gonna find a parking spot now. All right, look at that. Look at this little thing right here. Look at that. That's pretty cool, man. A speed bump would kill your fucking car, but that's pretty cool. There it is in the distance, men. Grab your shields, grab your armor, for tonight we died in hell. Okay, I gotta calm down. I feel like Gerard Butler all of a sudden. Anyway, guys, I got about four minutes left on this battery before it just dies out on me. I'm gonna go in there, and uh, I'm gonna see if I can find something. It's all the same shit they've had since 1995. Ah, the dragon has been slain! Actually, the dragon got the best of us today. Um, it's raining out, by the way. So I did buy something in Best Buy. Now, I'm not proud of myself. I don't feel like I found a good deal on it. If anything, in another week, this is gonna be like $6 somewhere. Uh, in another year, it's gonna be at the $5 Walmart bin, sitting at the bottom, covered in an old sticky goo. But I went ahead and bought the new RoboCop reboot movie. <laughs> PG-13? This movie was entertaining to me. Is it better than the original? No, he doesn't eat baby food. Um, but you know what? I, I went ahead and bought it. I had a gift card. If it wasn't for that gift card sitting in my wallet since Christmas time, I probably would not buy this. It was, uh, I price matched at Walmart for like $23. And speaking of, I gotta hold you guys in my hand. Speaking of Best Buy, yeah, you know what? If you guys are into buying movies and Blu-rays, it's dying out. Buy everything you want right now. Give it another three years from now, you're gonna see like one little aisle, an end cap with four movies on it, and that's all they're gonna have. So anyway, guys, that's gonna conclude this flick trip. My camera battery's literally dying, it's blinking. Uh, so maybe you guys will see this in the next movie night whenever I get the flip cave put together, painted, and ready to go. So anyway, guys, let me know your thoughts, your opinions down below. Thanks for watching. And if you want to see more flip trips, give me a thumbs up, and I'll see you next time. This shit is really coming down. I'm just waiting for Russell Crowe to roll by with those big rock creatures and start building a boat. If he doesn't let me on that son of a bitch, I'm going to climb on the back and start eating snakes. If you haven't seen the movie Noah, that makes no sense. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.